another brother is eating, and he's not in the tech world as far as I know, but you had this video talking about him. Have you seen him since? Michael Jordan. I knew you was about to do that. <laughs> I know you was about to do that to me. I mean, I got to I don't think I ever discussed this anywhere on radio. Yeah, no, I... Uh, it was Instagram or something. It was on Instagram, I think. I think maybe one time. Yeah. So what happened was, I told a story about Michael Jordan and how Michael Jordan just, uh, yeah, he's a rude guy, man. Yeah. <laughs> I, real I saw him people. at an event and he was just like real mean. You know what I'm saying? So there's two people in the world that I pops, possibly would ask for a, a autograph or or a picture with, and I didn't ask for an autograph. So I asked for, asked for a picture, and it's um Michael Jackson and Michael Jordan, them two. Wow. So rest in peace, Michael Jackson. Can't get a picture from him. But Michael Jordan, I happened to be leaving this event where Reggie Bush was at and Kim Kardashian at the time they was together, and um, I, I I I I raised my hand and you know, for an auction for a Michael Jordan jersey. So they're like bidding this Michael Jordan jersey, and they're like, we got this Michael Jordan jersey and all these other jerseys, a thousand dollars. I raised my hand, two thousand. Some other guy raised his hand, three thousand. I raised my hand. They keep going back and forth, and they get to like fifteen k, and then I just go over to the guy like, listen, man, you gotta chill out, bro. Like you making it go too high? Why don't we just stop? There's f there's uh, seven jerseys up there. I'll take three of them as long as I get the Jordan. You take four, and he's like, "Good, let's do it." So we stop raising our hands, and they say, "Sold to both of them, fifteen k." All right? Wow. So I'm supposed to pay seven k of that, not fifteen. You know, so I'm supposed to spend half of it. So then I say, um, I, then, "So then, unfortunately, this guy didn't even want the jerseys." He was just doing it because Kim Kardashian was up there, like showing it, and he was trying to show off to Kim Kardashian. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so he never, he even had no money, you know what I'm saying? So oh, they was like, oh, I didn't know this part. About yeah, they tried to stiff the whole bill on me, and I was just like, what? <laughs> Say, man, this whole time this dude going back and forth with me, I could have stopped at like three thousand or something, man. This dude oh, made it go to fifteen. So I'm like, man, whatever, right? So then I'm thinking about all that, uh, you know, on the way to this Jordan event. Then I bump into Michael Jordan, man. I. Everybody like, man, go take a picture of Michael Jordan. Go do it. I'm like, nah, bro, I ain't, I ain't gonna do that, man. Just, you know, oh. it's good. Cause I never ask anybody. You know, my favorite rapper, Jay Z, I see him all the time. Never ask him for a picture. It just ain't my thing. So then I was like, you know what? I saw him take some pictures with some girls. I'm like, you know what? He seemed like he had a good mood. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> Wrong move, man. I went over there, man. That dude was like, man, he started cursing and everything. No, he, he did. He cursed? Yeah, no, you never told me. You never told me. No, that. he did. He did, for sure. He, he cursed did. you out? I mean, did he, he really? said the N word. Like he called you the N? I mean, he, he, he in not directly of other in my face, but he was like, I ain't taking pictures with no N words. Wow. Maybe he didn't want to take no picture with no dudes. I, I didn't know how to. I, I I was trying to figure out what was going on at the time. I was like, wait a second, maybe he didn't hear what I said. <laughs> so then I turned and looked at my boys like, did y'all see that? And they, they, they saw some energy, they didn't know what he said. And I was just like, maybe he didn't hear what I said. And I turned to him and said, I just came from an event, bro. The, 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 the charity event with Reggie Bush. I just paid all this money for your jersey and then he was like i tell you what you and he, he mentioned the number and was like give me that amount right now and i'll take a picture with you and just looked at me he did not yes he did i would and that's when i knew it was real right there that's like oh at first i thought i was dreaming and this is real now and i'm telling i remember how he was looking he was super tall <laughs> he like very strong looking he got his eyes red he had a cup in his hand he was just looking at me like something you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Like, I, I was, I'm, I'm telling you, I started balling up my fist like that. Ah, oh, oh, swing man. on this boy right quick. Yeah, Angus Holmes, yeah. Angus Holmes on this boy right quick, man. Oh, That's man. what I wanted to do, you know? <laughs> quick, the quick. businessman in me was like, you know what? Don't do it. Don't do it, Cam. Yeah. <laughs> I, know, I know that I would have got jumped by a whole bunch of basketball players, but I was like, I would have been the one guy that hit Michael Jordan, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I was the one guy that got a lick on that chin, man. Woo. Has he ever tried to say anything to you after that day? Because I know Nah, that, that day I saw, good. like, you know, um, I saw Spike Lee was there, Charles Oakley, um, uh, Paul Pierce, all of them. Like, Paul Pierce was like, hey, chill, let's come in. He was like, I don't give a like, Michael Jordan said that, I was like, man, this dude is disrespectful. Like, <laughs> like, so I shook everybody's hand except for his and then walked off. And then, like, Ray Allen, Paul Pierce, all of them, they came over to, like, try to take pictures with me, like, pity pictures. Like, no, <laughs> <laughs> pity good. pictures. So after that, we leave, and I'm leaving, and I see, like, Young Jock coming in. And then Young Jock all mad. I'm like, man, what you, what you mad about? He's like, man, he all mad because he coming in on a red carpet, and they trying to, like, convince him to, uh, they, they tell him, like, why are you coming in here with Adidas on and you, this Jordan house, you know, and he like mad, like, Adidas, give me free shoes, what Jordan doing? He ain't out here helping us, like, you know, like, <laughs> wow. he going off on them, so he was mad coming in like that, and he was like, told me about that, and I said, well, no matter what you do, don't go say nothing, no matter what you do. <laughs> <laughs> and so I left, and then later on, my uh, security, this guy named Al in um, LA, and he was like, he said, hey man, Jordan trying to, Brian Jordan trying to reach you, I was like, why? He said, man, they said he want to send you some shoes, and all of I was like, they said they apologized to Jordan, and I was like, nah, I'm good. 
I just didn't take no shoes. Oh and man! I got some like free J's okay. and everything. But my question. Cause you had worn Jordans before. Yes, yeah, I still wear Jordans. Okay, okay, that's all. Even though he, done. even though he shot that disc, bro, we still... ain't finna make that dude any broken than he is. <laughs> Already too late, man. You, you just <laughs> like the shoe. Yeah, that's my favorite shoe. Like, okay. it, it, like the uh, Jordan Sixes is my favorite shoe is because it reminds me of that moment in high school. You know, that's what it is for me. Mm. It's a moment wow. for me. So I wear it because the same way you wear like uh, Barry Sanders, uh, Charles Barkley's or something. It reminds you of that time. Uh, like you mm. wear a Carl Cannot have. <laughs> I'll, hey, I'll get ready to about for the old school. You know what kind of joke, but I'm gonna yeah, let so slide if, if you want to talk about the economic things that Jordan doesn't do or does do, I'm not in that conversation. I'm not thinking like, oh, if he ever tried to reach out to you, would you? I think when Brand Jordan tried to reach out, I was just like, nah, I'm good. Because honestly, it happened. I, I didn't. People think that oh man, Cam got butt hurt over Michael Jordan. It, it, it wasn't even a big deal to me it, that day. It was, but after that, it was just like he's still the best. Player of all time. Yeah, you can't take that away. You know what I'm saying? So I think how the story happened is that I started telling people, like, I was making little jabs out of my rap songs. And people kept asking me, why you be doing that? So one day I was on Ustream. I was like, you know what? I'm going to tell y'all. And I told them. But it wasn't really that big a deal. Seriously. Yeah. So I, the funny thing is, everywhere I go now, I just came from Chicago, like, uh, last week. And everybody was like, hey, man, Michael Jordan. Every, everywhere <laughs> I go, it's like the start of the conversation. I was somewhere, I bumped into Damon Dash from Rockefeller. Mm-hmm. And I had never met him before. He was like, yo, the first thing he says, Man, did Michael really do you like that? <laughs> wow. And I was like, man, this dude ain't even said hi yet. And the yeah. first thing he said is, I don't believe Michael Jordan did you like that. So I bumped into some guys from, uh, they were uh, with Jordan on, on his, like, I don't know, they, they like basketball players that get endorsed by Jordan or something. Mm-hmm. And they was like, yo, I spoke to Jordan. I asked him, why you do Premier like that? And they said that he said, oh, I didn't know who he was. And they said that one of them came and told me. And I was like, I don't care who it was. You shouldn't talk about that thing. Anybody. Yeah.